trying to prove uncooperative and they're going without Pap's turf. They're off and racing. The opener on Coconut Cup Day here at Beverly is the Matthew Island Memorial EBF at Novice Stakes. A reminder of the two withdrawals, numbers two, Pap's turf, and at nine at San Bonner. Further messages to follow. Showing up prominently is footwork along the inside of two-man job, and they're chased towards the bend out of the far straight by Fuel the Fire, who goes very keenly along the inside of El Burhan. Racing next up in between horses is New Bombay. A length further behind those is Divine Legacy. A neck back then is Knight's Gold. And Dr. THG, the best turned out winner, is the trailer. And on the home turn is around about eight or nine lengths off the pace. On they go towards the final half a mile and the entrance to the home straight and they're being towed along by footwork under Sylvester de Souza. Sylvester who rode two winners here last night off the front. Trying to repeat the tactics here and seal this on board footwork who goes well is now two lengths in front of El Burhan who moves into second place and now looks menacing. Has got through along the inside of two man job. New Bombay trying to join in in the yellow cap. Knight's Gold is out deeper on the track and further back to fuel the fire. They're now less than two furlongs from home. Footwork in the white and dark blue colours now challenged to the outside by El Burhan and El Burhan now takes over as they make the journey on to the final furlong. El Burhan seems to have mastered footwork with back in behind those at Knight's Gold and then in fourth New Bombay but it's going to be a winning favourite in the first on the west but on Coconut Cup Day El Burhan is going to follow up his Yarmouth win and in the end do it in ready fashion has pulled right away El Burhan and Jim Crowley tight in the end for second place at footwork along the inside of Knight's Gold and they were chased home by Divine Legacy up in between New Bombay and Dr. THG. Yeah, it's pretty impressive, wasn't he? At El Burhan under the penalty for his Yarmouth win on his second start. Jim Crowley has uh, guided him to success here in a strongly on race, courtesy of footwork and Sylvester D'Souza. You might just